imagine for one minute that um, you're going downtown Vancouver to get a haircut. And if you're like me, you only need about 17 minutes to get that done. But by the time you find a place to park and go and get it done, it's 20 minutes is up. You come back to your car um, because you've left your laptop in the back seat, you covered up with a towel, and you find that uh, first thing you see is your towel's on the ground floor of the of the parking lot. Then you see that um, on top of the uh, your window smashed, uh, laptop's gone. You got all of your personal belongings, personal information in there, government business information, and the big project you were working on for six months. Well, you're you don't know what to do. Well, by the time you found out, it's sold on Hastings Street for $100. And um, we have patrols in our uh, volunteers. They have bikes. They go on foot. They patrol the neighborhoods, um, the parks. We par patrol the parking lots. And we always leave notes on cars that people leave something in them. If you, for example, leave your charger for your cell phone, well, that costs you 30 bucks. Your window smashed, $300 deductible. That thing sold on Hastings Street for five bucks. Um, we participate in outreach programs. This one is at the uh, Gathering Place Community Center. Every year they have a festival, and we go to uh, other outreach programs, Kids Safe, um, uh, places like uh, Beach Safety Days, etc. We have office staff. We Some people like to stay in the office and answer questions we get a lot of people coming in, oh, I'm lost. How do I get to this place? How do I make a report? How do I uh, do anything? And uh, the office staff knows how to handle that. We have, um, at this, uh, this picture, we're helping the Vancouver police with a distracted driving project. And we have ages anywhere uh, to, to 83. So anybody can, can volunteer at the Granville Policing Center. We do speed watch, which um, uh, with the ICBC and Granville Policing, um, Vancouver Police, we can get motors going a little over the speed, especially in 30, when they're going 60 in a 30 zone. Um, we participate with other city Vancouver projects, such as uh, this is a barricade, um, barricade monitoring uh, for the fireworks. And uh, we'll line up and prevent people from going down alleys um, off Thurlow Street. We participate. This is a candidate parade. That's our chief um, with us. And uh, we um, participate in all the VPD parades. Next one is the Visaki Parade. Graffiti cleanup. We do graffiti cleanup on the streets and in the back alleys. Uh, this is a uh, shot from the Pride Parade, one of our uh, most exciting parades that we enjoy. And we do park street, um, beach cleanup, and you can see how many bags we got from this one park that day. This was from the Santa Claus Parade. This is some of our volunteers. We try and have about 40 active volunteers at, at any one time. We work from 12 to uh, 4 o'clock every day, uh, Monday through Friday. We will be working a little later till 6 when, the late, when it starts getting late later. And that's what we do, and uh, we're always looking for volunteers. I've volunteered for 23 years with Vancouver Police, and I've got a lot of satisfaction out of that. Thank you very much.